Fam, let mm. me tell you something about Conte. And this this and this this goal hit this goes out to the fans, the Tottenham fans that want to be backing off backing Conte, yeah, sucking mm. him off, blood, whining him in carnival. Do you know them way there? For all you man that are sucking off Conte, yeah, and disrespecting like Pochettino, oh, what's he done? Duh, 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 duh. Pochettino got given nothing, yeah? Mm. And the man's still done more than Conte's ever done for us. Like, yeah, let me fact. just get a little zero sugar. Jerry, goat blood, you know them way there. Mm. Brothers, the destruction, no, we're oozing on the net. There's no other that you'd rather bounce, but ooze, no, we the best. Shelling on the pod this weekly. Comedy gold on your TV, smash that like, touch a button like Vico. Ready for the show, my G's. You see me? I said this bounce, sports ooze. I said this bounce, sports ooze. I said this band sports ooze, main event X run to roll need two. I said this band sports ooze. I said this band sports ooze. I said this band sports ooze. Express them rap, let me build that. Sh- Jeez, I'm expressions genetically jacked, athletically stacked, half man, half amazing, modern day Mac fam. And I win my brother. From the same mother, Ranceroni Escobar, you know he's banned Stradamus. And welcome to the only podcast where you're going to hear banter, you're going to hear sports, and it's oozing sauce. Band Sports Ooze episode 81, fam. What you telling me, fam? I'm all right. I'm all right. What do, you, you do you know? Do you know why I'm smiling, blood? Why? Ain't got nothing to do with the football, but I'm going to Dubai tomorrow, blood. Yes, I'm finished, are. blood. Nah, big man, ting, bro. I ain't smiling. You get me? I ain't got nothing. Forget, forget about all of that, fam. I'm on the plane to Dubes. You know them way there. Finally trying to catch me a W at the Emirates this season, blood. You know them way there. No, no, no. Honestly, fam, that's what it is, fam. Because if I'm honest, blood, it's been, bruv, it's been a miserable, blood. It's been a miserable time for me lately, blood, yeah. And I'm telling you, bruv, these last two weeks, blood, fam, fam, I had two cups in my eyes like Tory Lanes, blood, and Tottenham went out of them back to back like Aubrey, blood. You know them way there, fam. I'm telling you, fam. And even you, blood, the last week, blood, after holding that Dan the B Severin, blood, from Liverpool, blood, you know mm. what I'm saying, fam? Obviously, you man got a draw with... Who is it? South Arampton, blood. Mm. You know what I'm saying, fam? Man like Liu Kang Samiro, blood, with his forward forward triangle. What the hell? You know what I mean, fam? I don't know what he thought he was doing, blood. Man suspended, blood. You know what I mean, fam? He's not even free. He's out for four, like, low-key now, blood. You know what I'm saying, bruv? It's actually kind of mad, fam. And Rashford, we might as well get onto your game. Rashford as well, blood. You know what I'm saying? He went down in the box. Do you think that was a penalty? No, I don't think it was a penalty, but nah. he'd he been, he been touched, though. You know what it is, yeah, with the mm. Rashford situation, yeah. yeah. It's mad. Go on. Mm. I'm not gonna lie, he went down like he caught a knee from Tony Jar, blood. <laughs> nah, but you know what it is? The speed, like I said um on my stream, the, there was contact, but it wasn't a penalty. But the speed he, he was running at, any clip is always gonna send man off balance, innit? It wasn't a penalty though. But mm. the goalkeeper's pulled out, but the goalkeeper's knee has clipped his back foot. And then obviously that stopped his back foot from making contact with the ground, so he's fallen over. So he thinks that he's been fouled. And that's for Casemiro, blood. The man, the man seeing red like Cyclops in the X Men, blood. You know what I mean, fam? Do you think that was deserved? No, it wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, but you know what it is, yeah. Like the game of football, yeah, is just is past saving now. It's yeah, past I, saving. I don't think it was deserved. I think he should have got a yellow mm. for foul play and then a yellow for the VAR, blood. You get me? I don't think it should have been a straight red. What do you mean a yellow for the? V- bruv, listen. Listen what I'm saying. <laughs> football, yeah. Football. Football is beyond saving. The game's finished. The game's finished. VAR's trash anyway. Mm. What's the point in the referee seeing a tackle, giving a yellow card, and then going over to the VAR? Like, when you gave the yellow card, you acknowledged that you saw the tackle and you believed it was a yellow card challenge. Mm. So then why go over to the VAR? Furthermore, it wasn't even a foul. Mm. That's what the maddest thing about the whole situation is. Anything slowed down can look a million times worse, yeah, than anything. But like, you know when literally. someone commits a crime, yeah, the shopkeeper saw it, but they still need the CCTV, blood, in court. Yeah, but it's not the same thing, bro. Like, 
You know I mean? wrote like, it. The guy's in court. Like, the, if, <laughs> like, the shopkeeper. <laughs> Don't do this, man. <laughs> no, but bro, you're not making sense. No, nah, because obviously you're saying that man saw it. You get me? Bro, so if like, he saw it and he deemed it was a so yellow like, card offence yeah, and so he's like the, the shop, guy the officiating give, the game. <laughs> the shopkeeper will give a testimony. Then it's a yellow card. And then they'll review this. No, nah, but, nah, but that's not the same thing, bro. The shopkeeper, yeah, hasn't got the power to persecute no one and put them in jail, blood. They have to go to someone else. The referee makes the decisions whether it's a yellow card or a red card. He's the one who went to the screen and then changed the verdict. But you were literally within touching distance of the incident and you gave a yellow. Mm. And it wasn't even a yellow card. It wasn't even a foul. And you know what the funniest thing about the whole situation is, yeah? The player that was in question was consoling Casemiro after he got sent off because he knew it wasn't a red card. Everyone knew it wasn't like a red card. He was consoling card. him because he didn't want Casemiro to wait for him after the game. Like, that's why he was consoling Everyone him. Everyone knew honest. it wasn't a red card. If you've ever played the game at any level, yeah, you know that players tell on themselves, blood. Like, if the ball goes off the pitch, you can tell because players kind of instinctively stop. If it's a handball, players instinctively stop. Mm. That challenge there, one, the player, out of water, boy, the player like, wasn't hurt. Bobby Boucher. The blood. player got back up. And was like, right, like couldn't believe it was a red card. And you know what it was? Can't yeah. believe it was a, a good red... challenge because he did kind of get the ball, but it's, the, it's like the way his, his foot went over. And but it's not leg. that he kind he of leg. got the ball. Yeah. No, he got he the ball, but he hit his leg ball. as well. Yeah, but he went over the ball, over the top of the ball. Momentum does that. Mm. It wasn't excessive force. Do you know what I'm saying? It wasn't violent. It wasn't two feet off the floor going directly into man's legs. We could talk about what could have happened. It didn't happen. If it was granite justice, yeah. It doesn't you matter, know. bro. It doesn't matter who it was. <laughs> Because at the other end, yeah, Garnacho got clamped, yeah, in the box, yeah, and was Ooh. rolling around. Yeah, yeah. And the, the, it, Walker um, Peters scissors him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, he got the ball as well. He did. but And it was still a dangerous tackle, and he didn't even get a foul for that. And he could have broke man's ankle if we want to talk about could have. Do you know what I mean? So you know man, why? No, you know, you know the one thing I can say is why it's not consistent, yeah? Because that Newcastle game, that was a penalty, bruv, Nick Pope, blood. You see what he did with Wolves? Bruv. That was a penalty. Bro. That was a penalty. Not, not just that. that I was. think it was... What game did I see when man's ankle... Bruv, Joao Felix's ankle got clamped in the Chelsea game, yeah? Didn't even give a foul, blood. Yeah, nah, nah, but that wasn't a foul, blood. No, nah, nah, bro. Nah, it it nearly broke man's ankle. And this is it what happened. I'm... But you see what I'm saying? Like, these... What I hate about these referees, mm. what, not only are they inconsistent, but they're not... They're never held accountable. Yeah, they're yeah, They're never, yeah, ever yeah. held accountable. Mike they them up, blood. They ne exactly. They never have to sit down after a game and tell us exactly why they made the verdict they made. You mm. can't give a yellow card, yeah, then go and then just over to VAR. That don't make no sense, bruv. Do mm. you know what I mean? Because you saw it, bruv. Like, mm. clear and obvious. That's what VAR was supposed to be for. Mm. You clearly saw it, gave a yellow card. There was no need to go over there and change the verdict, bro. Mm. That didn't make no sense, bruv. And it wasn't even a foul. And that's the game of football now. If we're talking about... Uh, what could happen, then they should ban goalkeepers from punching the ball. Because yeah, the amount 100%. of time they come out to punch the ball <laughs> and punch man yeah, in the head, bro, yeah. you might knock someone out, Facts. you could kill someone, That's manslaughter, crazy. ban punching. But you don't ban that, though. Mm. Like, there's no consistency. If we're going to start sending players off for what might happen, yeah, then, bruv, there's no football left. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Barge man, into, to, the, they barge man into the fucking... Mm. Into the stands or something, man mm. might hit his head off the railings and die, bruv. I guess you can't budge no more. You know mm. the ones I see, man get pushed off the pitch all the time down into the sideboards. Ain't mm. a yellow card. No, but that's like two red cards in like what three weeks, blood. I'm bro, telling you, bruv. That Brazilian joke. Scott Simon, neither... <laughs> 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 and neither of them were red cards. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> neither of them were <laughs> red cards. <laughs> <laughs> and both of them looked worse <laughs> in <laughs> slow motion. It's peak, and this fam. is why people with common sense here. Yeah, should be referee in the game, bruv. Like not, Jay Huss. They're not even failed footballers. They, they never even got picked in their school team, <laughs> blood. You know them, And then they end up being referees, blood. They want to take revenge on footballers, blood. That's what they want to do. It's all these nerds, blood. That's the, bruv. That's what it is. Because if you you've know, ever played laughing. the game at any level, yeah, <laughs> like you can see that you have to watch things in real time. You yeah. don't watch them in slow motion. Yeah, nah, slow motion always does look worse. Man do know that still. You get me, fam. And when I looked at the cast, when I saw the Casemiro thing, in play, like it looked like, like yeah, he looked like he got the ball and that. But then no, when I saw he the did player, get the ball, but he went saw, over it. When I saw the player, I didn't see that. Um, I did, I didn't see him go over it the first time I saw it in it. Mm. But then when I saw the player rolling like Fred Nurse, but like Limp Biscuit, I was like, oh shit. And then I saw the replay. Then I saw how high his foot went after he touched the ball. That's probably why. He yeah, because it went the height of the ball because it yeah. rolled over the top of the ball. It's not his fault. The ball's a sphere, but like if it wasn't, it wouldn't roll. <laughs> you know what was there? If the ball wasn't that shape, it it's, wouldn't roll. Like, Roni's blaming the ball now. I no, but I'm saying he went over the ball. Like what? So what? Like that happens in football. I said it's the not... ball wasn't a sphere, blood. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but that's what I mean. You can't blame my man hey. that the ball rolled. 
The bull's meant to roll, blood. The bull wasn't a you spear, You know what I mean? Blood. The bull's meant no to limit, roll, blood. There's no limits of shamelessness to this guy if the, the bull wasn't the a bull, spear. No, but Man I'm saying... Man said ransom bands, my point, like waffling eggs, My blood. point Man is, yeah, <laughs> my said, point if is... If the bull wasn't a spear... The bull is supposed man. to roll, so you can't get mad that you the bull rolled, blood. the episode, yeah, remember I said for them to type in if the bull wasn't a spear, yeah? I swear, you're the best. I to know you are. No, because No, because people people want to go with the ifs and all this bullshit. He rolled over the ball. Of course he rolled over the ball. The ball rolls, blood. That's what the ball does. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Oh, so, like, it is what it is. Yeah. Like, <laughs> man can't be getting penalised because the ball's round, blood. Like, man can't get penalised for that. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, you it's, killed me, It's blood. bullshit, You're the bro. Best, blood. It's actually a dumb... The whole thing was dumb, innit? Four games, blood. Bruv. What games is he missing? Games that we should win anyway. So like, but I'm you no... don't really win many games without him. I swear. Like since he's coming, he's actually your main. You get no, me? but no, but bro, like we still win games, bro. You know what I mean? But we it, still win games. We got the most wins there. in Europe. Of but course, there's a, there's a big, yeah, there's, there's a, a big, big difference, difference not having Casemiro. He's a big player for us. Yeah. However, it's like and you got Savage. Could... No, he's injured too, isn't he? Sabitz is injured as well. The thing is, we could appeal it, but bro, again with Would these bu- to five games with these bum referees. Nah, the thing is, they never overturn it. The guy's gonna double down, yeah, because. <laughs> if they over overturn it, he has to admit that he got it wrong. He's not mm. gonna do that. Do you know what I mean? These referees never admit they got it mm. wrong, man. These guys are criminals, bro. I'm telling do you. You reckon he'll be in a new Mortal Kombat? Bro. <laughs> <laughs> these these referees, yeah. <laughs> these referees need to get relegated, blood. That's what needs to happen. These men need to be held accountable, yeah. yeah. And they need, bruv, they need something to happen to them. Because the same way players get bans, referees need to get bans, bro. There was yeah. one of them referees after the Arsenal game, I think he retired or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Or something um, like that, bro. Now nah, yeah. reinstate him, blood. That was nah, an injustice. Nah, that was bro. the biggest injustice. Nah, that's what heard. needs to happen, bro. Man needs to put that, pressure on these referees. Guy, yeah, the bro. Guy that, that retired, yeah, that was the yeah, biggest bro. injustice. Man United need fans need Arsenal to do what the Arsenal fans done, bro. Celebrating a man out of employment, bruv. You know them. Nah, what was his name again, blood? Because of Lee Mason. Was it Lee Mason? Maybe Lee Mason. I think this was Anthony Taylor that done that to us. Balls. I know I don't like this guy yeah. anyway, bruv. You know, like oh, that. Yeah. They need to run him out of football, blood. I'm oh, telling yeah. you, that's what that's what needs to happen to him, bruv. That flipping egghead, bruv. Any Taylor, bruv. You know I mean, peak, I'm bruv. tired of this guy, bro. You know what I mean? And the thing but is, even at Neil Neil, I'm not gonna lie, Southampton are dead food. You know mm-hmm. them way there, but you look at Neil, you're Neil Neil. What was it, 60 minutes? No, it was, was only it? 30 minutes. When 30, you got oh, 30, we had a whole hour with, with 10 men. Shit. Yeah, so 30 minutes, and uh, even there, like the game was good, blood. You get me, fam? Obviously. You wouldn't think United had 10 men. You get me? He's not like Southampton dominated. No, they didn't, like, bro. They Bruno were still playing for set pieces. Uh, yeah, Walker, Walker Peters. Had a, they both hit the post, you know yeah. what I mean? Walker Peters had a good chance. Ward Prowse, like, it was a, it was a decent A handball that weren't given. That was a handball that would have been given against us. When? You know, like what, that, what bro. Bro, handball in the box, but Southampton player. Ball rolls across. He's going to Veghorst. My man's on the floor. Stops it with his arm. It's no handball, yeah. Oh, they didn't, didn't even check. That. They didn't even check that on VAR. They're saying they checked. They didn't check that. Bro. <laughs> it was a handball, blood. Roni wasn't satisfied with the check, bro. It was a handball, blood. If he mm. if his hand doesn't stop the ball going through, it goes through to our player in the box and he scores, bro. Mm. Like it's bullshit. And that's the thing about inconsistency. These referees, they pick and choose when they go to the screen and check it. Mm. When they don't, do you know what I mean? How come the referee had to run over to check the VAR, yeah, for something that he saw? But then when they said that they did the check here yeah, for the handball, why didn't he go over to the screen again? Mm. He didn't go over to the screen. You know, like that. Well, you listen to the voice in your ear that time, bro. These yeah, guys bro. are pagans, bro. Well, and refereeing, blood. You know what I mean, bro? bro listen, been... I can't stand referees, bro. You no, know what I mean? You, At bro. any level, blood. I don't care. Do you know what I mean? Because you, you pay these guys, bro. Mm. And it's like, they don't know what they're doing, bro. Do you know what I mean? Like, I can't remember in my life many times, yeah, where man's praising referees, blood. No, do you know I what I'm saying, you. bro? They're terrible, fam. Do you know what I mean? And the thing is, like, just like football players, yeah, referees need to have a certain temperament as well. Mm. Do you know what I mean? To be a top player, you need to have a certain temperament, bruv, whether it's at the penalty spot, whether it's wherever. And as a ref, you need to have a certain temperament because there's so much going on. You need to be calm under pressure. And most of these guys bottle it, bruv. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Big decisions, they don't make them, bro. You know what I'm saying? And that's just what it is, bro. I, 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 hate. Bruv, I hate referees, blood. You know, like that. Across the board, blood. <laughs> you know what I mean? Make bruv, it, make it known. Blood, real talk, but if the ball wasn't as fair, fam. <clears throat> but... Yeah, blood. Nil, wasn't. nil. <laughs> you get me, blood. Nil, nil. Nil, nil, Man United, Southampton. Let's move on. You know them way there. What game should we move on to next, blood? Oh, no, bruv. Well, Liverpool, maybe. Who did they play, blood? I'm not going to lie. Let me just get a little zero sugar. Jerry. Coat, blood. You know them way there. Mm. In my system. Like Tinchy Strider, blood. In my system. <laughs> Let me check, blood. 
Jason Bournemouth one, Liver two, Box FC nil, blood. And I'm telling you, bro, after that seven, bro, the amount of chat that man was hit, bro. Liverpool, Liverpool fans came back to life, blood. I'm telling you, Evanescence, blood, bring me back to life. Wake me up, I can't wait. You know what I mean? These man were talking about fourth spot. You know what I mean? The quadruple. These man were talking about all sorts, bro. And I'm telling you, they are back to reality, fam. I'm telling you, these man went from Apple Max to back to typewriters. You know mm. what I mean, fam? That's what it is. Because the one they gave you seven, I seen bare Liverpool shirts in the gym. You know what I'm saying, fam? I was hearing a lot of chat in that, fam. I was thinking, oh, yeah, they were like Tottenham. You, man, are lucky to even be in the top four. We're coming for you, dear. We're coming for you. We're coming for you, bruv. Jason Bournemouth are bottom of the barrel, mm. blood. Do you know what I mean? I'm not going to lie, bruv. But the, the worst, bruv, Bournemouth, yeah. Southampton, yeah. Like, bro, Bournemouth, Southampton. Who's the worst teams? Southampton, yeah, Bournemouth. Bournemouth, Southampton. And is what, who else? Wolves, Leeds. Wolves, they're all down Leeds, there. Leeds, yeah, they're blood. All they're all, down they're down all of them, fam. You get mm. me? Like... They just but like you get me bottom of the barrel, fam. You know what I'm mm. saying, yeah. And blood, the way that they fist up Liverpool, Liverpool, they didn't look like winning that game. They didn't. Bruv. They you didn't. Get me? Even they got their that manager penalty. said, "Did you see the penalty, fam?" I saw the miss. Yeah. Yeah. Salah sent it to Dubai, blood. He sent it to saying, Dubai. Bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go collect that penalty for him, bruv. You know, <laughs> wait there. Nah, big man, ting, fam. On on a level, bro. Big man thing. One of the shakes were just sitting there, bruv, cheesing, fam. I nearly got his wig peeled back, blood. With <laughs> most Alice penalty, bruv. I swear down. It was peak, fam. I couldn't believe he missed it, blood. Believe it. You know them when just after he broke that record, boy, the Liverpool record. You see what yeah. I mean? And and this is just what it is, bro. Karma comes at these man fast. Cause you man been been avoiding me all season, you Liverpool man. Then all of a sudden, yeah, my phone's popping off, yep. blood. My phone's popping off. I'm hearing bear man saying, oh, so-and-so's calling you out, rants and that. You know them ones there, but them man were locking me outside the big six, blood. No, yeah. but I, bro, the let's man, just, no, no, come on, come on, let's not do that. Out, let's bro. not do that. Let's say names in it, blood. You know them way there. Obviously, for one night only, you get me, yeah? He, he, he returned back to Grizz Khan, innit? Because all season, it's been Riz Khan, innit? <laughs> let's be honest. Let's be honest. Don't go anywhere. Let's be honest, my G. It's been Riz Khan all season. Spliff after spliff. You get me? <laughs> one true. game, one week, yeah? He turned back to Grizz, blood. You know what I mean, yeah? That's what I'm saying. Nah, nah, nah. Man got to big him up, though. What is this, the name of his channel or his show name? It's Carnage, like, innit? Bad boy. When I saw spelled yeah. with the, the KH, he's a bad boy. Carnage, but it's satin carnage, blood. It's like 90 minute carnage or something, something like that. Like that yeah. Bro, you got to follow you, man. Follow him, you man. Liverpool fans, blood. Man, that, like that's, Grizzler. That's my guy as well. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. But, bro, you've been running, bro. Man, you've been, blue Grizzler. You've been silver. hiding from me, bro. <laughs> you've been hiding. Do you know what I mean? And hiding. shamelessly. Hiding. Bro, <laughs> them bro the amount of times man's been yeah. ducking me. And then as soon as they beat us, this guy was vocal. Man was hitting Mariah Kerry notes. All of a sudden, <laughs> man's everywhere, you know. <laughs> Couldn't believe man's yeah. adding me on adding me on Twitter, bruv. Like, bro, the guy has not added me all season, bruv. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden, it means nothing. Liverpool fans, all, all bruv, stocks going up in seven up because of the Liverpool fans. And you now know you're further there. behind us than you were after that game because you lost to Bournemouth. <laughs> you know, like that. So it just, the maths aren't mathing right now. Oh. Like, like, like my guy Flawless said, you went from chasing, yeah, a quadruple, yeah, to chasing the top four, blood, four trophies. To the fourth place, bro. That's where you've gone. And you've done that in 12 months, bruv. Seven. Yeah, seven year curse, curse for clock blood. That's the only seven you, man. Seven up. Nah, flawless. flawless seven up, seven like, year what curse, flawless bruv. say that was mad disrespectful, bloody He goes something about you lot are the best yeah, losers yeah, I know. Yeah, they something. are. The Super Saiyan Luigi. That's bro, what he that's... called them, man. <laughs> bro. And that's what they are, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? I, I said it from early. Klopp, yeah, is Pep's pad man, bruv. I'm telling you, man, just holding the mitts to make my him said, look good. Man said Liverpool are Marty Gennetti and that, bruv. Blood, blood. I remember when Liverpool fans wanted wanted a trophy that. for 99 points, blood. <laughs> you know what I mean? They wanted a trophy. 99 points, but a trophy ain't won, blood. That's Bruv, beat, I'm blood. telling you, bruv. Pep's pad man, Klopp, blood. They're doing the Mayweather thing, blood. You know what I'm saying? Nah, you're doing bare pats and that, bruv. You know them ones there? That's what you're doing, patting man's shoulders and that. That's all you did. Klopp's in trouble, man bro. That guy doesn't bruv, he doesn't, like, he just looks clueless, Seven year curse. Seven yeah. year curse, bro. Like they they used all their bullets on Man United. Do you know what I mean? And then they're firing blanks at Bournemouth. At the mm. end of the day, like I said, the, once the embarrassment wears off here, yeah, it's only three points. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? What's the point in beating us to go and lose to Bournemouth? Like people will say, oh, no one will remember that. Oh, we lost to Bournemouth. Yeah, but we'll remember, yeah, that you, man, yeah, the way you've capitulated under Klopp in one nah, season. Definitely. This season, you we'll, went we'll for remembered. four. Yeah. Four trophies. Last season, they were talking about quadruple. You know, Trent was saying, oh, yeah. The quadruple? Two down, hungry for yeah, more. Hungry and for that. More. He's starving. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Okay, yes, I <laughs> oh, What a good... <laughs> I, I sat down, bro. Oh, bro, hungry for more, you know. Hey, bro. <laughs> it's a mad, bro. Oh, my days. My man has to grow them dreads so he can hide his face. You know, bro, I wish there, I need blood. to watch it's the peak. watch along highlights, blood, so I can see that the reaction to the penalty mm. missed, blood, because I'm telling you, bro. Most spammer blood. That was that was sensational, bruv. I'm not gonna lie, it was actually sensational, yeah, bruv. You that still. You know what I mean, fam? Obviously, yeah, man. But yeah, Liverpool lose. You get me, fam? Let me move on to my game, blood. Tottenham beat Nottingham Forest three one. And if I'm, I'm gonna be honest here, in it, blood. You get me? And it's another reason why I'm cutting blood because I'm tired. Yeah, I'm tired of just. Like, yeah, yeah, man's been getting peppered week in, week out, yeah. We gotta win. What am I supposed to celebrate that? Mm. We won when it doesn't matter, bro. Mm. Nottingham Forest, and in fact, Nottingham Forest laid down, fam. Mia Khalifa. I'm being serious. Mm. I don't wanna, I'm not gonna go on, like, oh, yeah, you know what, we're back. Da, da, da. No, Nottingham Forest, like, they no one's come it. to White Hart Lane and done that, p- played like that, innit? Yeah, they weren't at it. I'm not saying that we didn't play well, yeah. Yeah, we did. We dominated the game. We could have had way, well more, you know what I'm saying? I look at things like Pedro Porro, fantastic game. Do you know them way there? Richarlison, my man of the match. Do you know them way there? His goal got ruled out and it was onside, blood. You get me, fam? So he ended up getting an assist and winning Kane the penalty. Man of the match, fam. Kane ended up scoring two. Son got his goal. Perisic didn't play any minutes, bruv, which showed why Son was actually able to play some football. But I don't want to see Perisic, bro, and Son play together. I don't. Left wing back. Ben Davis, bro. How long have I been saying, yeah, Ben Davis and Emerson left and right back? You get me? Even though it was Poro, that's what I'm saying because we didn't have Poro when I've been saying it. I want to see Davis there. Do you know what I'm saying? We are incomplete, blood. You get me, Cisco fam. You get me when Perisic is there, cutting Merchant. That's what it is. If he's not playing up there, uh, across the front three, man, don't want to see Perisic in defence in it. But I'm not gonna sit here, yeah. These man have knocked man out of two cups in two weeks, blood. You know them. I'm not gonna sit here, yeah. Go out of two trophies. Something that I want to celebrate the fact that we beat Nottingham Forest at home. That's a given, fam. I don't care if we got 10 men. I expect to beat Nottingham Forest. These man knocked us out of the FA Cup, bro. You get oh, yeah. me? No, Carabao Cup, sorry. Yeah. These man knocked us out of the Carabao Cup. Why didn't we beat them then? Mm-hmm. Do you get me? That's what I care about. You think I care about... Yeah, Liverpool lost. Newcastle won, but we're still in the top four. Bro... These are the same fans moaning about the owners. You get me? All the owners care about is top four, you know? Mm. They don't care about trophies. Yeah. You're getting sucked right in to what the owners want, blood. Who gives a damn about top four if you're not winning the Champions League? Yeah. Who? Uh, Who? Them, and the wickedest fans. thing is, yeah, what player in that? Name me one player that wouldn't have came to Tottenham if we didn't have Champions League that we signed. What, maybe Perisic? Mm. He's been dead anyway. Mm. Richarlison can't tell me, oh, yeah, it was only Champions League. Nah, less of that. Everton, you get me? Man was like, he nearly got relegated. Mm. Behave yourself. You get me? Basuma was at Brighton, bro. You get me, fam? Allow it. Spence wasn't even in the Premiership. Do yeah, you understand? You we didn't have players, a Champions League window. And mm. when's the last time we had a Champions League window? We don't have them. <laughs> yeah. So wouldn't you rather? No, nah, honestly, true, blood. Honestly. Honestly, if you want to chew the fat, I want a trophy, innit? You get me? Like, man, man's been talking about Champions League, Champions League. It's starting to celebrate over your rivals. Yeah, maybe. You get me? But it's not a trophy. Mm. You get me? It's not. It's not, fam. You get me? You think I care about if it was in the Europa League? We need to win that. Yeah. We need to win that. You get me? Like, like fam, I've, I've had enough. I've, I've solely had enough of man. Because I'm telling you, bro, when I put out my videos, yeah? My video after the thing we won 3-1... I'm seeing man be like, oh, but why is he so negative? Not on YouTube, just more on my Instagram. Why are you so negative? I'm realistic. Do you understand? I'm not going to sit here. Not in them forest. They folded, bro. Yeah, Watch the game. Forest, you never beat them. Thank you very much, blood. And I know there's no easy games, yeah? But that's the least that they could have mm-hmm. given us, blood. I'll celebrate the West Ham and the Chelsea wins. You get me, fam? Both of those got celebrated because of who we were facing. Yeah. But not in them forest. Yeah, I celebrate the goals as they go in. But other than that, what is, what's there to talk about other than reflect on the, um, the shit sandwich that these men have been feeding me for the whole season? You get me? What? what ne- Come on, fam. I want these Tottenham fans to comment below right now. If we get top four, yeah, you'll be happy now because that's all we've got left. Do you understand, yeah? Mm-hmm. But revert back the season. Let's, let's, just, let's just go back to clean slate. First game of the season, yeah? Someone tells you, Tottenham, you want top four. That, that's it. That's all you get. You're going to be happy. I'm not. 
Mm. I came into this. I didn't care about top four. I care about a trophy, you know. Mm. That's what yeah, it but is. That's what isn't everyone it? said when Conte took over, they're like, he has to win them some trophy. That's what it yeah. is, isn't it? A mm. trophy, yeah. this, that, and the other. And then Conte's coming out saying top four is a trophy to us, bro. He's ripping mm. us to pieces. Do you know <laughs> what I mean? Him, he said it's better than winning the league or the same as winning. Yeah, the league. he said yeah. top four is is win like winning the league for Tottenham. Yeah, bro. that's what he you said. know them way there, fam. Let mm. me tell you something about Conte and this this and this this go hit this goes out to the fans, the Tottenham fans. That want to be backing off, backing Conte, yeah, sucking mm. him off, bruv, whining him in carnival. Do you know them way there? For all you man that are sucking off Conte, yeah, and disrespecting like Pochettino, oh, what's he done? Da, 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 da. Pochettino got given nothing, yeah? Mm. And the man still done more than Conte's ever done for us. Yeah, facts. Yeah? If you want to talk about that, Champions League final, mate. Yeah, he's done more than Mourinho's ever done for us because because um, Pochettino's got us to a cup final as well. So what are you talking about? Do you know them mm. way there, fam? I'm not hearing any of that shit, bro. Pochettino was heavily disrespected by Tottenham, fam. We made the mistake. You get me, yeah? Conte's moaning about this, that and the other. I ain't seen a manager that that's getting more support than Conte's got out of this board. I haven't seen it. People might be like, oh, yeah, but it's not what Conte did. did, did. Bruv. A manager... Bro, they brought in his DOF, yeah, and then gave him players, blood. What blood. do you want? Paratici's... Exactly. Player. Fraser Forster, yeah, and fucking Perisic, yeah. Come on, bro. Let's be honest, G. During age of a retirement guy. You know what I'm saying, fam? We don't usually do these things. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? That's it. We don't do these things. We're doing these things to suit man, yeah? yeah. Do you know what I'm saying, fam? A man is still moaning, blood. You get me, fam? Yeah, I could understand that you probably want a G Vardy all and all of these things. You were never getting that at Tottenham, bruv. Let's be honest. <laughs> You get me, fam? No, honestly, fam. He would not go and talk. What did I say been... his name wrong? Yeah, but it doesn't matter. Oh, oh okay. I no. said, why are you laughing? I thought that was his name, blood. No, ain't bro. Right? Vardy, oh, but it doesn't matter, yeah, bro. Like, he wasn't so going there. what the fuck there. did G for? He ain't Jamaican. Why is he silent in letters <laughs> yeah, for? Yeah, but he's an European or something. But, bro, either way, mm. yeah, mm. He's been linked with Chelsea. Like he's not gonna go to. <laughs> he's not gonna go to Tottenham. Wait, I don't know why he's laughing. <laughs> <laughs> not gonna go to Tottenham, bro. Like so Chelsea are to gonna pay him. Name. <laughs> Chelsea, Chelsea are gonna pay him like three hundred grand a week, and he's gonna go to Tottenham for one fifty. No way. I'm Bastoni. Yeah, and yeah. All, I mean, them guys these... ain't going to Tottenham no, for that little blood. money. They're gonna no, go rich blood. Chelsea. But bro. that's what I'm saying, innit? You know what I mean? Like, fam, it's one of them ones where, yeah. Conte's done nothing but disrespect, man. Don't get me wrong. At first, when he was talking I'm about trying the board, to bring up the average age of your squad, yeah, bro. He bro, all he's done is disrespect, man, fam, and then suck man off like Chelsea. Oh, with Chelsea, you know very well. Uh. Man, don't want to hear man sucking off a man's enemies, bro. Man, don't want to hear that. That's like man going into a boxing fight, and my coach here yeah, is is, te- uh, is talking about how good of a fighter that brother <laughs> is, blood. <laughs> yeah, like good. honestly, it's embarrassing. I ain't trying to hear that. Do you know what I mean, fam? Tony with a toupee needs to cut, fam. I'd sack him immediately. Do you understand? You man and might, you know what? You man might as off? well have kept. What's his name? Um, your right back, blood. Right back. The Maddie blood. Aurier. Yeah, you might as well have kept him because man didn't like Spence. You know them ones. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Aurier no, no, is no. closer to the age that he likes his right yeah, backs. Yeah, nah, yeah, nah, he's really. the old right backs, blood. What nah, was the point no. in getting rid of Aurier? Yeah, bringing in Spence and then not playing him. Yeah, nah, I know, I know, I know, I know. But that's it. That's Conte. It's like. <laughs> Conte didn't want him in it. Like the like Tottenham brought him in, yeah. You get me? Yeah. I thought, oh yeah, you know what? We could tell him what to do. And Conte said, you can't tell me shit, blood. <laughs> yeah. That's what it was, fam. And he froze man out, blood. That's pretty much what it was. That gin and juice Snoop Dogg go to France now, blood. Eating croissants. He's playing blood. well there as well. Yeah, he is, blood. You know what I mean? He had a stinker though. I'm not gonna lie. When they went out of the cup and that, and then yeah. the camera was all coming up to yeah, my face, and he was, and he was like, like, just said, move, man. You get me, fam? Yeah, that's what it was. But yeah, nah. And you know what, what annoyed me the most, yeah, this morning when I woke up, yeah, look, look at this, bro. Let me show you what, what I saw when I woke up, yeah. You get me, fam? My Lord. One second, blood. One second. Oh, where is it, bro? Did I not save it? Videos. All right, here we go. David Ornstein. Tottenham are linked to Enrique, yeah. Man like Iglesias, yeah. Pochettino. Dragon Ball Zerbi, yeah. Ryan Mason, blood. And they've got Ryan Mason's photo up there, fam. You can't be Ryan, to Ryan Mason. He's already at the club. Blood, let me tell you this, yeah? <laughs> no, no, no. Let me tell you this. Let me tell you this, yeah? I'm telling you this right now. No cap. No cap. Look me dead in my eye. If they hire Ryan Mason to be our permanent manager, I'm not renewing my season ticket. No way. I might even move to America and just do it full-time streams. Now, I'm being serious. Mm. I ain't going back to watch Ryan Mason's Tottenham Hotspur. Mm. I'm not going. Mm. You get me? Don't go on like it's an Arteta thing because it's not, blood. Arteta was underneath Pep, yeah? What's, what's Ryan Mason's under his wife? You know, them way there. Do you know what I mean? 
Like, nah, don't piss me off. Don't do that to man. They will not be seeing my money, bro. You get me? All two and a half grand for the two season tickets that man has to... You're not seeing that money. You're not seeing it, blood. Do you know them way there, fam? Don't piss me off. Don't piss me off. I mean, the wickedest thing is, yeah, it's like Pochettino's not even close, blood. They, they, they're saying that, oh, it's going to be someone else. Bro, Enrique, yeah, the guy that played for uh, Spain, ma national manager, innit? Enrique, innit? Yeah, Luis yeah? Enrique. He did a good job for what Spain had, innit? You get yeah, me? In yeah, the World Cup. With them players, he but ain't doing shit. Fam? <clears throat> I don't want to... I don't want to be disrespectful, but bro, just give me the devil I know, innit? Like, bro, I'm swear down. I'm, I've seen fossil football for so long. Yeah. I swear, I've just had enough. Like, I've legit had enough of watching this this crap. And because... we say, mate, have you playing some good football, but it'll be losing football with the players you've got. You know the ones that look good, but you, man, will be getting smoked. Yeah, no, nah, but At we need... At least knows we need... how he's got a combination of good football and also a bit of pragmatism where you're not going to be getting smoked with him, innit? Luis Enrique will need his kind of players. So it's going to be a whole rebuild all over again. The only you... time I've seen us get smoked got money like was the Bayern Munich game. Yeah, but Munich can smoke anyone. Man. And that was, he was out of, yeah, get me. Like, mm. Yeah, man, man, man know we needed a new team, innit? Like mm. he'd said, he'd said, innit? Mm. Poch came out and saying that Tottenham might need to go for a painful rebuild and we ended up sacking him, bro. Do you get me, fam? That's what it is. It's, well, it just is what it is, fam. It is what it is. But yeah, we won 3-1. Kane scored a penalty, a sensational header. And Song got the third one. They got a goal. And even Fraser Forster, blood, he saved the penalty, blood. You know what I mean, fam? Man like Fraser, you That's know, what he did, phrase, fam. Bro. Man like Bob the Builder, bruv. Yet me saved the Fraser Forster. Can he save it? Yes, he did, blood. You know what I mean? Big him up. And he had a very good game as well, blood. Obviously, he didn't have nothing to do. But the two chances that them lot did have, the yeah, guy was the reaction. It, yeah. You know what I mean? Reaction Jackson, blood. He was on it, fam. Do you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Big him up, fam. Stop! Before we continue with the episode, I just want to let you know that this episode is brought to you by HelloFresh, fam. You guys know I can't cook, blood. The only cooking I do is on YouTube, fam. I'm cooking your favourite YouTubers week after week, and you know I go to the gym. I'm not talking about Kerry. I'm talking about pumping steel. So I need meals, fam. Get HelloFresh and skip that long trip to the grocery store. Spend more time doing things you love with delicious chef-crafted recipes delivered straight to your door are you looking for an easy way to save money cut back on all them expensive takeaways eat healthy hello fresh is the one for you fam you can whip up a restaurant quality meal in your yard couple ingredients wham bam thank you ma'am no matter your lifestyle or meal preferences from fit and wholesome or veg and family friendly we've got something for everyone and we're sharing them like teddy fam hello fresh's latest line of meals feature robust flavors fam and filling portions and they're ready in less than 15 minutes. I'm talking recipes like falafel, power bowls, seared steak with potatoes, and berenade sauce, fam. Or Southwest pork and bean burritos. I use it, so why don't you? You can use code BANTS60 for 60% off and free shipping, fam. That's BANTS, B A N T Z, 60 at HelloFresh.com. Just know. Oh, blood, let's just get to it, Free blood. Free nil at Chicken Cottage, blood. Free yeah. nil at Chicken Cottage, blood. And, that's bro, like let me tell you this, chicken yeah. Cottage, bro. That's got to be... And I, Man, are going to be like, oh, these men are haters. Da -da 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 -da. No, no, it's got nothing to do with hate, yeah. One thing I'm going to say is, yeah, before you Arsenal fans just be like, oh, you man are biased. Da -da -da -da. After that, Walking Maltese has got a whole show called the Bias Premier League show. But if I want to be biased about Arsenal, I can. You think I care? Mm. You know, now, big man thing. Do you, do you think I care? Do you know what I'm saying? Now, now honestly, lad, buy a sports ooze, innit? We'll change the name. You get me, fam? Yeah, fam. The way I see it is, yeah, let me... This, this is one thing I'll give you, yeah? Man City are scraping past teams like Crystal Palace and Arsenal are slapping teams like Fulham 3-0, innit? You know them way there, yeah? That's one thing I'll give you. You lot are winning um, dominantly, yeah? But you see that Fulham game? That's got to be one of the worst defending I've seen, blood. Fam, the first goal, yeah, Gabriel Freeman like Morgan, yeah. Bro, the, second the second goal, goal that bum, Callum, what's his name? Callum, what's that for? Brav, the only Robinson that can't concentrate. What's his name? Clyde know. Robinson or Callum Robinson. Troops is brethren, you know, he threw the game. <laughs> you, no, he did. <laughs> Bro. Flipping kid and play, when blood. When you let him out he threw Eddie, the yeah, get free headers, yeah, like, in, and he's not even someone that heads the ball. You know bro, what I mean, right? Martinelli's it? jumping like crisscross. Yeah, that you was You know crazy. what I mean? That was crazy, bro. I'm not going to lie, bro. Trossard like, with, with free assists, though, blood. Yeah, yeah, I can't yeah. lie, blood. Played well. He's a good player, though. Yeah, but You fam, know what's mad, He yeah? is a good player. Very good you player. You know what's mad? It's like, Fulham weight all season, the way they're performing, yeah, 
to then Arsenal cut and just give them the game, bro. That's what I'll never understand. But this is the one thing I said, yeah. Like, you see when you've got players that play for teams that aren't, they don't have pressure on them to win. Mm. It's different. Mm -hmm. When they go to a bigger club, a lot of the time they can't do it because, yeah, they look good at a smaller team, but when they go out there, there's no pressure to perform. Mm. Like, the burden of performance is on the players at bigger clubs, bro. So when you come up against Arsenal and you play for Fulham, yeah, and you're in good form... The only one that had a good game was Leno, you know? Yeah, but, but bro, that says everything. Do you understand? That says everything, bro. And remember, save he's been save, he's been like, places. He's and he's been places before he was at Arsenal. Mm. So you, he's been places. But most of these Fulham men ain't been nowhere or they're old, blood. Mm. You know, like that. So these man got there's, folded there's, there's no pressure nil, on blood. these guys to perform every single week. They're overperforming. Mm. And then when all of a sudden people are looking at him, that oh, maybe you can do something. They didn't mm. do nothing. The mm. Fulham that we expected to turn up, turned up. The mm -hmm. Fulham that we expected to turn up all season. The team that should be getting rolled over by teams. Mm. So it just shows you these men are overperforming. And that's why mm. when fans always say to me, oh, would you take this player? And mm. they're at teams like Brighton and all these places. It's like, bro, there's no burden to perform. There's no pressure to perform at these clubs. Mm -hmm. Doesn't mean when they come to their, their, your club, they're going to do shit. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Like the, Bryan, the, the Brighton winger at the moment... I think the, the Japanese brother Matoma, yeah? Everyone's like, will you take Matoma? I was like, yeah, he's doing well at Brighton. Mm. But so what? So was Basuma, blood. You know, mm. like that. Now you can't get a game at Tottenham. Mm. You know, like that. So it's just one of them things where, like, when the burden to perform is on these smaller teams, sooner or later, they're going to put in performances like that, innit? Back mm. down to reality. And Arsenal dealt with them the way they're meant to deal with them. Yeah, you know, no, like 100%. that. And Jesus is back as well, blood. Exactly, bro. How long was he out for? A few months, bruv. Uh, since the World Cup, remember? <laughs> Oh boy, my Jesus rose in three days, blood. You know, then we... <laughs> like, you know, like that, fam. Yeah, a shout, a shout out the one, blood. You know yeah, what man. I mean, blood? Now, you get me. But yeah, nah, that's what I'm saying. Even Jesus is back now. So, yeah, blood. Yeah, but they got a lie. spring in their step, man. These Arsenal they fans They got Crystal the Palace moment. next week. Who, 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 Crystal who, who, Palace never... Bro, had, bro they ain't had a shot on target. Three, three, blood. Oh, shit, three now. <laughs> Palace ain't had a shot on target, Roni, yeah, and Arsenal got three points. And City aren't even playing, which means Arsenal can go eight points clear, blood. Yeah, City know, are in, in playing the FA Cup, blood. I know, but you know what's mad so about Arsenal that? Arsenal should clear, smash blood. them, man. I think they, they will. will. I think they will, but... At the Emirates, you know what bro, was funny? You know what was funny? Mm. You know what J-Rock said in the group? Yeah, after Bournemouth, yeah, we mm. got this mad run of that. You know what it was? What, is that what, what you lot, Man United got yeah. a mad run? Or Liverpool? Liverpool, in the group. He said in the group chat, he goes, after this Bournemouth game, we yeah. got a mad run because they got Real Madrid, Chelsea, Man City, all of that. And then they got beat by Bournemouth. So sometimes you just can't overlook no teams in the Prem. Oh, my day. You know that you can't overlook no teams in the Prem. Real Madrid's Premier. not really a mad game for them because that's, that, that game's that over. That game's over already. <laughs> yeah, it is. But you can't overlook, yeah, any team in the Premier League. I believe Arsenal will go there and deal with Crystal Palace, yeah, mm -hmm. differently. Because it's about not even go there. Arsenal at home. I believe mm. Arsenal will deal with them differently. Especially with you defending know, like, like that from Elise, bro. Let's move on to the Man City game, bro. 1-0. Oh, bruv, that brother just gave baller, Carlin bro. that penalty, bruv. Like, honestly, like, what kind of shocking... Bruv, the man just switched. Oh, I see that from Davis and Sanchez every time, game, man. blood. You get me, fam? Elise just switched off and then Harlem put in that penalty. But that's what I'm saying. Live, uh, Man City are scraping past these teams, blood. And Arsenal are winning prolifically, blood. But this is the thing Pep said, yeah? They asked Pep in a press conference, I watched mm. it, and they said to Pep, um, what's the difference now with having Holland and not having him in mm. terms of like stylistically, have you had to adapt? And he was basically saying, yeah, obviously we've had to. Do mm. you know what I'm saying? And, and he was saying that there's a tendency sometimes to try and want to go to him too quickly mm. because they're basically they're playing for him, is mm -hmm. what he said. And usually they don't. Usually they have three or four people. Do you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, and, yeah, And this is yeah. the thing. Like, he understands that their their playing style is in transition and it, and it makes them slightly more predictable. But I think because he's got him, he's got to kind of try and make it work, innit? Because mm. if he doesn't play Haaland, then he that's Pep admitting that he got it wrong. And mm. I don't think Pep would admit that, bro. Like, his ego is too big. So mm. because of that, I think he's going to die on that Haaland hill, blood. And that could end up costing them the title. Mm. Literally. Because bro, they, they could have just dropped man time ago, use it as an impact. That's what Thingy wants to cut, blood. Um, Argentine Terrera, blood. I don't know his name. Already? Yeah, Alvarez. He wants, yeah, he wants to cut, blood. He doesn't get a game. Yeah, he doesn't. He, he said doesn't. he was promised this and that, and you get me. Remember, yeah. they signed him before Holland, blood. They did, they did. You know what did. I mean, fam? 
And then now, it might just be frozen right, out. They signed you him don't first. get a game. He was meant to be like the wonder kid. He was meant to get all yeah. this. He was meant to be the new Aguero. Where then did they, they sign him Holland. from? They signed him from Argentina, I believe. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. No, he was meant to be the guy, blood. And he's a good player. He probably plays for Argentina, isn't it? Yeah. You, you know, know what I'm saying? Good player. So, yeah. No, not surprised he wants to What's leave. his name? Alvarez. Um, Alvarez City. Who did they buy him from? It might be like River Plate. Or, you know. Yeah. Oh, their, their manager was in... Um, was spotted in London, um, River Plate's manager. I don't know. It why. was River Plate. He was at, innit? Um, yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. It was. Yeah, 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 yeah. River Plate. River Plate. Yeah. Bro, but that, that's football, innit? And what I don't think that Holland was a planned signing from Man City. I believe mm. that he just became available, mm. and they just decided to do the deal without thinking, and now they're kind of stuck with him. That's what it looks like because mm. they wouldn't have signed Alvarez like that. Do mm. you know what I'm saying? If if they didn't plan to use him. Like, that didn't make no sense. They could have signed him and then sent him back out on loan. No, real Because they're not using, man, at all. How old you is know, he? like that. He's young. I think he's, like, early 20s, I believe. But that's what I'm saying, bro. He's not, that's what I'm saying, man. And like, Holland's Rico young Lewis as well. So, like, they're the same it? age. Like, mm. similar ages. So, it's like, it's not a thing where man's getting old and that. Like, they're the same age, pretty much. Like, they're mm. both kids. But one's further along in his development... And one, or should I say, one's just got better PR because mm. Alvarez is probably better than him. Like, do you know what I mean? All round. How old is Harlan? Like 21 or something. Yeah, 21, 22 or something. He just don't look like he's an Android fam. That's In why. Dog years, blood. <laughs> like, about, 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 about 21, blood. What are you talking yeah, about? Bro, 21, 22 or something, bro. I think My he's man. like Sanchez's age. They're like 22, I swear, bruv. Nah, bruv, bro. check man's age because, fam, bruv, it's nah, crazy. These men are old, bro. I can't believe it. Him. Costa, who's all these footballers that just look like three times their ages, blood? Yeah, early. Harlan, yeah. Costa, blood. I swear down, there's a few of them, fam. I'm not even. Bro, he's 22, lie. blood. I told oh, you. 22. 22 BC, Harlan, fam. Bro. I can't believe that. That's crazy. That's what I'm saying. So he ain't got nowhere, no time. He ain't got no time. It looks to... like he's lived 22 lives and that. That's crazy, bro. So, like, if you're Alvarez, you're fuming, innit? But Man City are playing for him. And it's killing the team. It's making them more predictable. Mm. And overall, it's making them a worse team, innit? But also, you got to bear in mind as well that they kind of are a worse team because they've lost the pace that they had in Jesus and Sterling. Mm. The Bruins are a year older and probably a kilo heavier, bruv. You know the ones there, like? <laughs> nah, bro. <laughs> He's so out of shape, bruv. <laughs> like, it's unbelievable. The guy can't run no more. Like, when you watch old videos of Kevin De Bruyne, yeah, when he used to be able to carry the ball, <laughs> it's like, he can't run no more. You know, like, he can't run no more, bro. And they're trying to accommodate him almost in, like, a number 10 role now. Know what I mean? Which means, yeah, that they've got one less player in midfield. They've got one... They've got one less player in midfield. One less player involved in the build up, yeah, and then they're trying to play Bernardo with some false left back. And that Pep is having a midlife <laughs> crisis, bruv. I swear down, Pep has lost his mind, bruv. Oh. I see Bernardo Silva, false left back. Yeah, and he, needs, he needs to stop taking a piss, bro. Krispy Kreme you know I mean? De Bruyne, you know, man's the, taking a piss. Nah, bro. but bro, Kevin blood. it's just like Pep's border winning now. Do you know yeah. what I mean? It's like he's border winning, so now he's trying to do a rebuild. In the middle of the season, like with no window and that, he's bro, a he's weird a fool guy, bro. Anyway, bro, getting rid of Cancelo now. Cancelo's just on the bench and buying from. He ain't even start their last game. Oh. He's been frozen out. He, bro, again, I don't know what's going on with it's him. His attitude, bro. I you know what it. they're saying. They're saying that oh, he's used to playing in a four and not as a wing back or something like that. But bro, Cancelo can play as a wing back, bro. It's not that. I just think. Bro, yeah. taking him in a heartbeat. I just bro. think something's going on with him in his personal life, bro. Yeah. Because I think his house got. Um, burgled or something. What, in Germany or in no, Italy? in England. Oh, is it? I think before the World Cup. Oh yeah, no, we saw. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because he got his. Yeah, that's yeah, where he yeah. got his face bust or yeah, something. Yeah, he did. And he then, did, he did. Oh, and since then, he's he's not playing at Portugal. Then he's not playing at. He's not playing at Man City. So maybe something's going on in his personal yeah. life, and he's just lost his head, bro. Which is very very likely, bro, because all these things kind of go in hand in hand, in it. Because mm. he's a good player. So the fact that he's not playing at either level, it must be something with his behaviour or something. It mm. has to be because it's not his ability. Mm. So maybe he's just going through some shit, bruv. And people just don't take those things into account, innit? No, nah, mental health matters, bro. You know them way there. No, 100%. Like, he's he's too, probably bro. just going through something, you know, like mm. that. And it's just... And it's just kind of manifested itself like that, bruv. That's the only thing I could think of. Because mm -hmm. it's not ability. 
No, no, no. Cause no, you know no, what I mean? Because Bayern don't have a better right back than not him. Not at all. He's, he's you know quality, what I mean? Man City, Man City don't have a better left back than him. They're struggling. They don't have a better right back than him either. I you like that. He, so he's, he's the best in both their positions. Well, like, that's what I'm me. saying. So the fact that he's me. not there, I think it was something to do with like he probably Trust had a falling me, out like, with Pep and Pep. In his don't later forgive. years, all, all we've been seeing is Kyle Walker get exposed, blood. Then when he's not exposing himself, blood, you know them ones there. Like Allegedly. it is what it is. Nah, bro, it's not alleged, bro. There's videos. Bro, nah, he thought he was Barry Barry Allen, the Flash, <laughs> blood. You know them way there, blood. You know how we? That's what I said. The fastest man alive, blood. You know. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. My name's Barry Allen, and I'm the fastest man. At man. <laughs> <laughs> and like the Flash, bruv, Carlinio, bruv. My fondling a woman, and it's not his wife, blood. You know what I mean? Carl Walker. My, like, I didn't my, even my, know he was Matt married. Hancock, blood. You I, know didn't even, I didn't even know he was married, blood. Bro, listen, Carl yeah. Walker, like, that was he got from, done with the prozies and Yeah, that. You, he's doing like, the grizzly parties. Yeah, you know, bro, them he was having a lockdown. lockdown party. Yeah, you know fam. that one's Carl Walker, blood. Yeah, bro. Listen. The Flash, you know, that yeah. guy's mad. He's a madman. He's out in these streets, blood. You know he is, that, blood. Bro. You know what I mean, brother? You know what made me laugh the most, yeah? Man left that same, after flashing and that, yeah? Man left with a macaron jacket on, blood. The training jacket, you know? Like, Man City. Man was wearing a Man City macaron training jacket over the Balenciaga t-shirt and that. Man literally was out here behaving yeah, it, like that in, in, in your his, uniform. Yeah, in his uniform. That's, that's like man, that's like man, man, man going out here and doing badness with an Asda Happy to Help badge. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? <laughs> That's <laughs> what so up. Nah, I can't. Yo, you're just doing bandits. Yo, give me your phone, blood. And it, it says my man's name. Happy to help, blood. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, Kyle Walker. Happy to help man. yourself and that, blood. Nah, Kyle Walker. That's a mad team. Yeah, Kyle it? Walker. You, you, you see, fucking. Me? They were asking Pepper about it, and Pep was just like, listen. It's a, it's a it's a personal matter. Yeah, and also he's like the times we live in now, these footballers need to understand, and he's right, mm. that outside of your house, you don't have a private life. You don't. You don't have one. Everywhere you go, there could be a camera on you mm. because someone's phone, you know, like that. Everyone you speak to, you know mm. what I mean? There could be some sort of agenda, bruv. Like, you're just not safe, in it. Like, so you can't live a normal life. You can't do things that normal people do that, mm. that nobody even... You know what I mean? No one bats an eyelid at. And mm. that's what I'm saying, bro. So it's one of them things where, like, Pep understands, yeah, like, personally, it's just like when Grealish went and got absolutely trolleyed, yeah? Mm. Like, you know what I mean? In the celebrations and that. Mm. Like, normal guys, like, if you ever achieve something like that in life, yeah, you're going to go out and party. Mm. You know them ones, but because Grealish was trolleyed and that, like, it's just all over the papers. But that's just normal behaviour for someone that's 24 years old. Nah, real talk. Just won a league. Real talk. You know, like that. So... It's just one of them things where these guys do not have that's a normal behavior life. for someone that's twenty four in general. Bro. Yeah, but that's what yeah, I'm trying to say. League. You get that's me? Ma, ma, I mean. ma, ma, go to work for five days a week and get trolleyed on a Saturday, blood. Bro, Celebrating you know I mean? being off work and then go back to work stinking a booze, yeah. blood. You know, like yeah, that. So, like, it's normal behavior. I'm telling you, fam, them guys that come to work smelling of vodka and that blood. You know that they, 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 their heels are in their boot and that. You know bruv, you know like that? Yeah, crazy, was in the heels in the boot, blood, and the dress, blood. Yeah, you know the ones that came straight from my man's yard, blood. I lie? Real Monday talk, morning blood. and that. I'm telling you, You know you, like fam. that? Nah, it's yeah, crazy, One bro. clip on I eyelash go missing and that, That's blood. it, it's got the overnight bag, blood, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, bro. You, bro. The cotton wool balls and that to take the makeup mm, off, Big blood. man thing, bro. I'm telling you, so nah, it just, it's just normal. The only about is their breath and that, blood. You know what I mean? Mad thing. Yeah, nah, absolutely, blood. But yeah, let's move on. Um, Chelsea... You get me, fam? Didn't they win? I swear they won like 3 1 or something like that. Yeah, Chelsea won, blood. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Chelsea won 3 1. Like, I think it's the first time Potter's won two games in a week, blood. Do you know what I mean? Now you've turned the corner. Potter in, guys. Leicester's really in the mud now, bro. Leicester, bro. My Leicester God. Are awful, though, bro. Like, you get me. Literally, Brendan's only keeping his job because no one else wants it, blood. Like, mm -hmm. I'm sure no one else wants that job. Mm -hmm. Like, he's probably working in some horrendous conditions, blood, because, mm -hmm. like, he hasn't, he hasn't quit. They haven't sacked him, you know mm. what I mean? So, and I refuse to believe that they haven't been trying to get someone else to replace him. It's just that no one wants that job, man. There's no money to spend mm. for whatever reason. I think, I think they're, I think they were building something new or something which meant they could. No, that's Everton. Everton mm. were building a new stadium. It's no Leicester just haven't been spending money. I don't know why, mm. but there's just not money there. You got unhappy players. Tielem has been trying but to leave for the for last season for like ninety million. I know, they? but maybe they needed the money because mm. Tielemans like been trying to leave for like the last two seasons still mm. there Madison I think is in the last year of his contract like mm. there's just a lot of things going on at Leicester bruv and yeah it's peak fam 3-1 you know who scored for them mm. I don't even know blood I think it was um, I know Havertz scored a chip 
No, I think Havertz scored two, blood. Oh, yeah, Havertz, Hav- I think Havertz scored two, or was that the Champions League game? Because they won two games this week. I know who didn't score for them, blood. You get me, fam. Man, like um, Mikhailo Mud, blood. You know them way there, oh, yeah. fam. No, that guy in magic, got... blood. You know them oh, way there. Oh, Android, food. yeah, you got an assist, though, innit? That's what they were Krillin's saying. Krillin's gal. Krillin's gal. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah no, blood. No. Android 18. That's an Android blood. 18. Krillin's gal. Yeah, no, blood. no. That's what he said Android. Like. I said it had to be Krillin's yeah, gal. Blood. You're just talking that's about. You're taking the piss. That's what it looks like, blood. Android 18, blood. He got an assist. These guys were saying, oh, yeah, man of the match. Oh, he got an assist? Like, yeah, he got an assist. Mad thing. Guys, He's finally got bastard. off the mark. Yeah, off, off Saturn, bruv. You know them way there? <laughs> right, off the molly, blood. I'm <laughs> telling you, bruv. That guy is not a good footballer, blood. You know what I mean? These guys are trying to gas this Mudrick guy up, man. He's not. 80 million, still. fam. Bruv, and then Arsenal went and got Trossard for, what, 20-something million? Yeah. Bro, Arsenal are laughing, bruv. They're laughing at Chelsea, bro. Mikhailo They're Madrid, laughing, bruv. Oh, my God. Nah, Chelsea ain't, Chelsea ain't it though, bruv. But long live Graham Potter though. Mm. Long live that guy. They're yeah, still nah, tempt, real talk, you know? real Two talk. wins that's, in a week to be tempt. But that's Didn't sensational, know? isn't it? You get me? Keep, keep him in that job, blood. Keep him in, blood. You know what I mean? Uh, Brighton leads 2-2. I didn't see that game, no. Nope. I didn't see it. Um, Everton versus Brentford, 1-0. Deitch, bruv. Sean Deitch, Steve Austin got the win. Bruv, he's gonna... Bruv, I told, man, this guy's gonna do what it takes, yeah? He'll mm-hmm. just keep them up. He just will. He's got the right kind of players for the shit house football he wants to play. Do you know mm. what I'm saying? Like that's just what it is, Sean Dyche. Man, have to give him his flowers if he keeps them up because they look, bruv, They want the highway to hell with lampoon. Man, I'm <laughs> telling you, bro. Nah, real talk, blood. So nah, Sean Dyche, nah, that's a big win for them as well. Big win. Nah, it is a big win. Brentford are having Brentford, a good yeah, season. Yeah, Brentford are having you know a saying? good season, so, blood. It's a Ivan Tony's up there with the um goals and Thomas Frank, isn't it? Even yeah. he was um looked at for for Tottenham and that, but for me. Like, I think it's too big of a jump, in it. Yeah, 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 hundred percent. Again, it's the go. it's about pressure, isn't yeah, it? Like nah, I said, about it. pressure to perform too week in week out. I you don't think me? that's it for him. Like, we still ain't had no update on Tony either. Like, what are they doing with him? Didn't they say it's a big ban or something? No, but like someone that? leaked, yeah, yeah, that he was getting a six month ban. But then he came out on Instagram mm. saying no verdict has been reached and he don't like the fact that people are putting stuff out there that ain't true and stuff oh, like that, it? but he can't speak on it too much because of legal situations and whatnot and whatnot. Yeah. So it's not definitely six months. I think it's probably going to be like three, three months, bro. Like Kieran Trippier only got a six week ban when he done his one. Yeah. Yeah, he only got a six week ban, bro. So. Yeah, but there's, t- there's one major difference between Kieran Trippier I know, and I know, Ivan I know. Dhoni, blah. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I hear that, fam. Don't don't let Trippier's shape up fool you, blood. Yeah, man. Right. <laughs> you get me, fam. Just like when I'm with troops, like, like when I'm mm-hmm. out with troops, and be like, yeah, but I am too. But we never be like, listen, troops. I'm but black fam, in every country we go to, innit? You're black in certain countries. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, nah, I let him know that. Nah, it's big man, team. We go Turkey. You got IC three and you got the IC. That man are telling him inshallah and in that, yeah. blood. Nah, I'm telling you. Nah, 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 nah. It's it's facts. Do you get me? It's true. It's facts. You know what I'm saying, blood? <laughs> Whereas me, trust me, man's calling me an N-bomb everywhere I go. Like, and that's just facts. No, nah, it's true. I haven't told you you're going to get the book thrown at him still. But... I was like, oh, in Russia, they didn't spit at me, blood. I said, yeah, they probably spit at Robbie. <laughs> yeah, facts. You know what I mean? <laughs> and I was only playing, blood. You know, then when they big up Russia. <laughs> yeah, hey, Robbie, you know, the way Robbie always gets corn, blood. I swear, <laughs> man. But for me, he just always gets hit with strays, blood. Every week, blood. <laughs> <laughs> Must be from you, blood. I swear down, bro. I don't know, but that's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, West Ham, Aston Villa, 1-1. One, one. Yeah, blood. West Ham, they're another team that... that they're like, trash, and they yeah, were losing man. as well. Yeah. Couldn't believe it. They were at home as well, innit? Because yep. they were 1-0 down to Villa, and I saw that. I was like, no way, bro. Mm-hmm. These men these man are trying to really flirt with relegation. It'll then be interesting to see what West Ham do at the end of the season with Moyes, you know? Because obviously mm. they won't go down. But they got a decision to make at the end of the season, bruv, because mm. clearly he ain't getting what he's meant to be getting out of those players. Mm. Because they should not be nowhere near that. No, I remember when, like, you get me, you turned from David to Goliath Moyes, blood, in like, his first in few Europe. seasons. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they got to the final. You mm. get me, fam. Of the Europa. They lost to a team That was sausages. only the other day, blood. Yeah, That Frankfurt. might have been last, it last was season. Last season. It was last season. Don't you remember when a guy pitch invading yeah, and yeah, Antonio, yeah, Antonio was like, the money's good. Like, the money's good. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, remember, I remember. That was last season. Yeah, fam. That's what I'm saying, blood. That's peak. Honestly, bruv. That's what I'm saying. So it's, it's actually kind of mad. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's going on with West Ham? And like, they bought man... that scammer car. They bought... Bro, um, they bought the Paqueta. Brazilian brand, Paqueta. Yeah. yeah, so it's not that they ain't spent money. No, bro. They How come I spend money. money and get worse, blood? Oh, I guess Chelsea do that all the time. Yeah, no, nah, real talk, blood. You, you know, know what like I mean? that? That's what I'm saying, fam. Even Nottingham Forest, bro. The man bought that like, 24-man, blood. 
yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's true. Spent money and got worse. Bare players, black. Yeah, real you know too. I mean? So it's, it's crazy, man. It's absolutely crazy. And l- l- final game, Newcastle versus Wolves. They beat them two one, blood. And again, Wolves should have had a penalty, fam. Wolves should have had a penalty. Bro, you know what it is, yeah. Like when you're down, they I'm say when you're down the bottom, off. things. Saying, go, yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. It should have been a penalty. But they say when you're down the bottom, things just go against you, innit? Yeah. Wolves be will be looking at it saying, bruv, if that's the other way around, it gets given, innit? That's some joke thing, fam. You get me, fam? Like, Pope didn't know what to do with his feet, blood. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he just didn't know what to do. But this is the thing with goalkeepers, like, it's, it's oh my days, it's so jarring, bruv. They get away with murder, bro. Mm. And because most of the time when they make challenges, it's in the box and the mm. ref knows they have to give a penalty if they give something, they don't mm. give anything. Mm. And that's what I mean about refs bottling big decisions. That's why when I hear... Um, football fans saying, "Oh, if it was anywhere else on the pitch and that, nah, bro, a foul's a foul, blood. Mm, like, mm. do you know what I mean? Give the penalty, like, do you know mm. what I'm saying? Like, whether it's shirt pulling, whether it's anything, give the penalty. Because then, when you do that, it then sets precedent for everyone to just mm. know that a foul's a foul. Because mm. certain men say, oh yeah, yeah, it's because it was in the box, yeah. Oh, it's a harsh. No, it's a foul or it's not a foul, bro. Because mm, mm, a penalty's mm. just a foul, yeah." In the penalty area, bro. Like, mm, you know what I mean, mm. there shouldn't be no special stipulations for when man give. Penalty. No, but that's what I'm saying. A foul's you know a foul know? wherever it happens on the damn pitch, blood. But that's exactly what it is. But man, are more reluctant to give fouls, yeah, in the box, yeah, because mm. what comes with it, and that's mm. that's what I mean about referees bottling it, bro. Like it's mm. either by the letter of the law, you just call every foul a foul, or these men should have to explain themselves after the match mm. as to why you didn't give it. No, nah, real. Talk. Do you know what I'm saying? Because bullshit like that, bro. Like imagine if Wolves end up getting relegated. Mm. of that loss imagine if they needed it. one point you know to stay up and that's that game crazy. is the reason why they went down yeah that's crazy bro that's, that's what I mean crazy. it's bullshit bro it's unacceptable bro and that's why bruv like I'll never like refs blood. Mm. I'll never like them no that's madness like that's madness bro I'm telling you fam and I think that was the last game blood mm. you know them way there um it ain't been it wasn't it wasn't a great it wasn't it's not been a great uh Couple games for you, Man United drew and Helvetia, blood. They couldn't get the win in Manchester either, fam. What happened, blood? No. Nope. I heard you moaning about referees. Was that about Casemiro or was that Helvetia? It was both. <laughs> it was both. I told you, I don't like referees, bro. No, it's just one of them things. And again, what was the score? 5 2 it was. Do you know what I mean? And we were 1 0 up as well. Oh, is it? 1 0 up. Yeah, bro. Fuming. 1 0 up. Then it ended up being 3 2. And then, bro, like, you can see the two late goals, but by then we were going for it. Do you know mm. what I mean? But it's just, it's annoying, isn't it? Like, it's one of them ones where the momentum was shifting in the game. I still don't think we played as well as as we have played this season. And also, we haven't played as well as I know we can play. Blood, didn't but, that man get a man sent off and then he carried on playing? That's what Dave told me. No, the guy should have been sent off and they didn't send him off. That's what they done. The guy was already on a yellow card yeah. and they should have given him a second yellow and the ref bottled it and didn't give him the second yellow. Okay. And we would have been playing against less players. And then the funny thing is, yeah, where one, it's 1-1. One, one. Mm. There's two minutes to go of the first half. Mm. My player is on a breakaway. We've got a 3v2. They foul my player. Mm. They don't give a foul because if they gave the foul, they would have had to give us a penalty because the other team already had five fouls and the sixth foul in futsal goes to a penalty. No matter where it is. No matter where it is. Oh, swear down. Yeah. So, the ref bottled that decision, didn't give the penalty. At what score? At 1-1. One, one. Okay. Yeah. And then they go, they literally counter from that and mm. score and make it 2-1, yeah? Literally off the back of the That's foul. That's like what happened in a fucking Newcastle game. Yeah, you know, Newcastle <laughs> scored straight after yeah, Walsh but, but that that's, but that's what I'm saying. And this is what happens, you see? It was, the momentum shifts in games, yeah? Mm. You can't, there's no stat for that. Like, when you're at a game, you know when you're on top. Yeah, do you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. And you know when you get opportunities to change the game. Because if we score that pen and we make it 2-1 and mm. we go into half time 2-1 up, yeah? Mm. One, if we we get the penalty, they don't get the opportunity to score that goal. Mm. And two, yeah, if we score that goal and we go in at 2-1, the whole psychology is different. Mm. Going in at half time when you're 2-1 down, as opposed to going in 2-1 up. It's a different mm, mm, game plan. Mm, mm, Do you know what I mean? The momentum's different. And all these little things, yeah, referees don't get to, to sit down and explain, 
why a blatant foul you didn't give. And the reason why you didn't give it is because you knew you had to give a penalty. You might get fined, Roni. No, 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 it's fine. No, 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 it's fine. Do it. You know what I mean? No, do it, bro. Because, no, bro, the reason why I'm saying do it. I can't get fined, innit? No, but. Yeah, you refs are bums, blood. You know them way there. We talking about, fam. Honestly, no, a man pays your wages, fam. Imagine that, blood. No, but He pays your wages. No, 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 fuck that, fam. Get me, you refs, blood. I'm telling you, you man are making money because of these clubs. Imagine the same clubs that are paying you to ref the game. You're screwing over, blood. No, but what bro, sense does that make, but bro? Blood? It's just the same with the police, bro. That's why the police have to wear cameras, bro. Because you pay taxes, <laughs> yeah. You pay taxes. You pay their wages. They work for you, blood. Do you know what I mean? So they have to explain when they do things, bro. Police can't just decide. Oh, you know what? We're just gonna arrest you. Oh, why? Oh, no. Yeah, because they can't tell you because they have to tell you why. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, referees don't have to explain the bullshit that they do, bro. It's not right. Because uh, clubs are paying these guys to officiate and they're making decisions and there's no accountability, mm. bro. There has to be accountability, bro. It's ridiculous. Mm. There was multiple times in that game, yeah, where the momentum was in our favour and we didn't get things, bro. And it's mad frustrating, bro. Mm. And the thing is, all man just need to do is sit down and say, you know what? I didn't give a foul because X, Y, Z. Sit down and look at the fucking... If you can sit down next to me, yeah, watch the video, yeah, and look mm. me in the eye and tell me it's not a foul, yeah? <laughs> cool, isn't it? <laughs> but, but most of these men can't do it. You yeah. know, like that. And that's just what it is, bro. This is the problem. Momentum in games, especially at futsal, it's like basketball, it's end-to-end. Like, one minute you can be 3-0 up, then you mm. can be 6-3 down. Like, mm. literally, it gets like that. So, decisions are even more important. Do you know what I'm saying? And there's two refs. There's one on each line. So there's not really an excuse. Mm, mm, In mm. football, a ref can say, oh, I didn't see it. Like, there's literally one on each side of the court mm. going up and down the side. So the likelihood that they didn't see anything is even smaller because there's two people there. Mm. You know, like that. Rain so, Stevie, blood. You so, know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's what it is. So, bro, it's what it that's is. That's why I get angry, innit? That's why I get angry because I know there's two refs. Mm. And the thing is, it's just not consistent, bro. And I know how important decisions are like teams play for penalties mm. like try and win fouls to get these penalties it's a tactic mm. why not use it if you've got good dribblers that can draw fouls like a Grealish or something like that that can draw fouls mm. if you can draw five fouls and then they can't tackle you now for say five minutes because if they tackle you and risk giving a foul away it's a penalty mm. so naturally teams are pulling out of challenges and you're more likely to score because they can't be as aggressive defensively mm. so it's a tactic do you know what I mean? But as a team, if you earn five fouls, then mm. we get to the last foul, then all of a sudden the ref don't want to give the foul because it's a penalty. What's the point in earning them fouls? You know, like yeah, that. You're right. It's fucking, bro, it's disheartening, bro. Like, that's what it is, man. It's bullshit. And then at half time, the fouls reset to zero. Yeah. So we had like three minutes where they were on five fouls and we could have been winning penalties yeah, yeah. and stuff. Ref didn't give it. It's like building up your finisher in WWE SmackDown and then they reverse <laughs> it. <laughs> like, <laughs> That's exactly what it is, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, man? Built the bar all the way up. Then you go to use your finisher, bro. Oh my days, fam. Man just reversed the finisher. It's gone, bro. That's exactly... <laughs> bro, that's exactly what it is, bro. Oh my days. That's exactly what it is. Oh my God. And it's just like, bro, oh. when, when I see stuff, stuff like that makes me angry. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Because me, I know, yeah. Mm. I know the level of quality that my boys have. So I know that I never saw the best of them. So mm. I know that they still have to hold some responsibility for why we didn't win that game. Mm. But at least I want them to get what they're, what they're owed at least. You know, mm. them ones there. Give man what man deserve. Because if man get the penalty and then we miss it, cool. Do you know what I'm saying? But give man the opportunity to go in How at far half time. are the penalties in futsal? Because them goals there's, are small. It's like no, hockey goals, yeah, blood. They are, but there's so two, there, there's two anyway? penalties. There's a long penalty which is the one you get for 5,000. And then there's a close penalty. What's a long one? A long like, one. Is it like is... a normal penalty? Like... No, it's a lot further out. So they're a lot harder to score. And so then like there's a, a close... With no one there? Yeah. And then okay. there's and then there's a close penalty. Can you pass it or you have to shoot? You have to shoot. And then there's a closer okay. penalty, which most of the time people score. But those get saved as well. Because these yeah. goalkeepers, if you've got a big keeper, yeah. like a keeper just... Bro, but that's like... what I'm saying. You just put Don Robbie in goal, blood. You're undefeated. Like, no, honestly, blood, I know he's busy with DR Sports and that, but can't you just break him off a little change, fam? No, it's that's hard. the league done. It is hard, no, yeah, serious, to score he's making in, just... in Bro, I saw Robbie playing this this, this, this table football thing, blood. They get... AFTV got some sponsors. You know when you're just sitting at the table, yeah, you're you looking at, the at table each other and you're, you you're yeah, doing that, yeah? They sponsored the FCAs or whatever that we were... And obviously, 
Like, Robbie ain't seen his feet in years, blood. So it's one of them ones where, it, like, he should be used to that. I thought he would have been the best one at, at, at table football because you're not supposed to look in it. You're supposed to just do it like that, yeah? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These are the strays that you, you keep you need to stop doing about Robbie. He doesn't deserve it. That's my employer, you know? So, like, yeah. And it's one of them ones, one of them. You know what I mean? So it's one of them ones where, like, I saw him doing this, yeah, and this, that, and the other, blood. When he went to kick the ball, it was him versus Tobes, innit? Yeah, when he went to kick the ball, blood, I, feel, I thought the table was going to explode, blood. Like like the, like the, the Dudley boys, fam, you know what I mean? 3D and that, blood. Ding, 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 ding. So, right, I'm telling you, why don't you just put my man in the goal? You get me, fam? So, you got to focus on his scoring. You ain't conceding, blood. Nah. <laughs> you get me? Bro, you're a madman, but... I'm serious! Nah, but... That wasn't serious. If the brother all. stands in goal, who's scoring? Tell the truth. Actually, tell the truth. I've seen the futsal goal. No, no, no. You're right. If you've got a big goalkeeper like that, it's very difficult because the ball just hit. He them. could be on, bro. Robbie could be literally. He doesn't even have to look at the game. He could be on the phone. Like, he could be on the phone. <laughs> yeah, but bro, he could be on the phone to Jason and these that. These futsal goalkeepers just be hitting him in the back agile. of the These men are doing. Like, these men are doing split saves and that. So. Yeah, I mean, it's not for the thing. Yeah, hearted, yeah but they're doing that because they have to, blood. Mm. You get me? Because they're athletic. But when you're robletic, <laughs> you know, then we're there. You can just do your thing, fam. I'm telling you. That's my guy, you know. I'm telling you, fam. fam Big him up. Piece, but, um, yeah, now, nah, in other news, um, Leon Edwards and Kamari Usman, that's coming up. Yeah. You know what I mean? The UFC, the, you're the rematch. later. The rematch. I'm not gonna lie, fam. I hope Lightning Leon, Lone strike Yeah, I hope Leon in, Edwards wins, yeah, but yeah. I can't he only see won. It yeah, because in both fights he had, he was no, he was losing. Like, but that's what I mean. He was losing. But not, I mean, you always me. got to punch his chance. Exactly. It's just like when I see the Smith Eubank rematch. I yeah. think that Eubank's gonna deal with him because he's gonna mm. respect him more and he's gonna make sure yeah that he doesn't come in. Yeah, but Chris Eubank bullshit. thought he was Eddie Gordo. He's there but, dancing but, like an but, idiot. But this is exactly you know, what, what I'm saying. If you saw the size of that thing under yeah, his eye, bro, that's that guy embarrassing. Had a hockey ball in his eye, bro. Bro, you know that was saying? that was a cricket ball, blood. Mm. You know them way there. He got blad. smoked because, he, and the thing is, he won the first round, but he was coming in all loose, doing the jab mm. and all that, bro. He's not gonna come in fighting like that for the second fight. No, and he'll talk. deal with it. And it's just like Usman as well. Mm. Usman's gonna come back in here, yeah, like literally on the game plan, and his awareness is gonna be even more heightened because he knows, yeah. That, that kick can sleep him, bro. So he's gonna mm. make sure he doesn't get caught with that. Do you know nah, what I mean? And he talk, was behind. Man. So it's one of them on nails and that. So his <laughs> eyes deal. were open and shit. Man. <laughs> Usman's it was peak. gonna deal with his him. eyes were open, fam. You know what I mean? His eyes were open. <laughs> Usman's gonna deal with him still. That is you know peak, saying? fam. You know them way there, blood. Man, 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 get knocked out with his eyes open, blood. Like that's actually mad. Yeah, but but you get knocked out by the shots that you don't see in it. So <laughs> it's one of them ones where yeah, man, he got slapped over his eyes open, did it? You went there. You know what I mean, man? Held a super slap, bro. And um, W for G Lins, blood. He's back in the chair, fam. And BBC match of the day have apologized as well, blood. You know them way right there. What? Yeah, bro. They've apologized since look, when? Look, look, blood. I saw it. I tweeted it this morning, blood. Off the impartial row, blood. And they're apologizing as well. I saw that. I, I, that's not um fake news. They're, they're, they're apologizing. You pussy. Actually, let me go on to 360. Let me show you. Let you see what happens. You see what happens, well, yeah? Bro. You see what happens when you mobilize, yeah? TV, bro. You see what happens when you flip and mobilize, yeah? And you stick it on these people, bro. And this this is what I'm saying about this. And a change to their social media guidelines. Do you know them way there, fam? Bap. Look at that. You know them way there. Bro, bun, bun the BBC anyway, bro. Mm? You can't say ban the BBC. You know, I'm walking BBC. You know what I mean? You can't be banning me, fam. The gal they change that. their guidelines. They're man are idiots anyway. And the reason why these men are idiots, yeah, is because these were the ones, yeah, when it was Qatar, yeah, these ones were the ones that didn't show the ceremony and were doing all this. They, they, they were quick to mix politics with football. Do you mm. know what I mean? And they still decided to cover the World Cup, but then they were trying to do these things and Gary Lineker was trying to do all his virtue signaling and all that. Mm. So on this thing, I believe, yeah, cool, Gary Lineker was um unfairly treated and stuff like that but bro them man are all hypocrites he's a hypocrite mm. do you know what i mean and the bbc are hypocrites as well because when it comes to qatar they wanted to talk their rubbish yeah mm. then all of a sudden he says something about um the state of this country and all of a sudden yeah he's breaking the rules blood but you lot you lot were pushing the propaganda mm. for the world cup so they can all fuck off really do you no. know what i mean like my my takeaway from this is yeah that it shows when you mobilize against the powers that be they can't do shit, bruv. Because at the end of the day, when everyone started boycotting them and saying, yo, cool, if Gary's not coming, I'm not coming. All of a sudden, they had to apologise. Yeah, I like the way that they did that as well. Yeah, but, like that needs to, but, they, they, but they, that needs to be across like the board. Yeah. That needs to be across the board with 100%. everything. 100%. You know them ones? It's just the same with this government. The people in this country, if you don't mm. like something, if everyone decides 
that we're not going to work, bro. The economy crashes, yeah, and the country's fucked, bro. It's just that people are shook, bro. Do you know what I mean? These guys are not scared because they've got money anyway. Mm. The reason why Gary Lineker, Ian Wright, all these guys can say, cool, we're not coming is because they've got other work. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? And that's how they stop man from mobilising because people are afraid to not have shit. Mm. And that's why in countries where people don't have shit, that's where the revolutions are because they ain't got nothing to lose, blood. No, you're right, now, I mean, bro. Ian Wright never had nothing to lose by not going on match of the day, blood. Mm. Neither did Gary Lineker. He, bro, he could just get a job at B in sports, bro. Mm. Do you know what mm. I mean? Like, mm. Keys and fucking... Um, Keys and Andy Gray got kicked off Sky Sports and now they're doing B in sports, bro. Oh, and they're making it? more money. Okay. Yeah, bro. Like, bro, there's always somewhere for them man to go. So mm. as much as people say, oh, yeah, it was brave. It's not brave, blood. They were getting money. They could get money somewhere else. Mm. They weren't risking going broke to do mm. it, to make a statement. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? And it's the same with, like man was saying, with the racism yeah. in football, blood. If all the black players say, all right, cool, this guy got racially abused. What? Two 10 grand fine? Not good enough. None of us are playing. To be fair, anyone that didn't stand with Gary would have been cooked anyway. Exactly. You know, yeah. Yeah. But that's it. You get me? Ian Wright would have been called a bounty. And all the, <laughs> no, yeah, no well, all of these things would have happened. Yeah, but to you be know, fair, it's one of them um, ones where, yes, like even Piers Morgan tweeted, yeah, saying anyone that takes that match of the day job, you will be Alan judged Shira accordingly. Alan called, called Bruce Willis, blood. You know them way there, <laughs> Yeah. Man's acting like, what's his name? Stallone, blood. You get me? The white man, Freddy, blood. You know what I mean, bruv? That bruv. That, he called, bruv, I watch, I watch. What's that show that I watch, blood? Tulsa King, blood. The white man, Freddy blood you get me <laughs> he's a bad boy in that thing hey he beat one gal yeah bro and then she found his driver license she said you're 70 blood he's 70 years old blood he beat one thing that was in like her 30 she couldn't believe it yeah you bro. get me blood yo listen the white man Freddy, blood this brother got co- end up calling one black guy n-bomb blood on tmz blood <laughs> no i swear down the other day bro you know man like stallone and that when they're not on camera yeah they're calling us all sorts do you know them yeah, way there you can just look in this yeah you, know ones, bruv, you yeah. can look at a man's face and know what they're on off yeah, camera bruv, hulk hogan, hogan sylvester there, stallone all them man bro yeah, them man, uh, yeah, you get me dropping smoke. bare n-bombs blood yeah, you get me smoky still but I like the white man Freddy fam. I swear, when I was watching that show, I was like, yo, that's my guy. And then when I saw the controversy, I was like, yeah, that's why he's not my guy, blood. <laughs> yeah, nah. He's all got a black driver as well, blood. There ain't going to be a season two after what I saw. <laughs> Do you know what I mean, blood? They better change the driver, fam. You know nah, what I'm that's saying? That's facts, man. But Can't yeah, the, the, the Lineker thing, yeah, I just think it's a shambles all round, innit? Mm. But again, it just shows you, innit? Like, we're just living in a society now where, bruv, the court of fucking social justice, bruv, wanna try and decide whether man's got a job or not. Mm, it's bullshit, mm, mm. fam. You know the ones like even saw it with Adidas and Kanye. They've had to do a three sixty on the Kanye yeah. because they're losing money. Yeah, of course. You know, like that. Gonna happen. And that was always gonna happen. And that's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Like a bit of outrage online. Yeezy, want... you know, Yeezy is the only reason why I wear Adidas. Yeah, of course. Like, I don't wear free stripe Adidas. Yeah, nobody does. I wear Yeezys. Nobody does. You get me? I don't you wear no free stripe yeah. Adidas. Bro. Yeah. Let's be honest, innit? Man, don't do that. Literally. You get me? Man I used to wear shell toes. I mm. used to wanted a pair of shell toes, just like I used to wanted a pair of Reeboks. Like, yeah. man, ain't Andy Cole anymore. So like, let's let's be honest, innit? Like, it's facts, bro. And this is what it is. And the thing is, we're in a society now where, yeah, like, men are trying to, like, end deals and stuff yeah. like that, yeah, based off man's Twitter reactions. And yeah. That. We're in a weird place, bro. We are. And it's funny, like, I saw something somewhere, and I think a man said, yeah, back in the day, yeah, you used to worry about someone working hard harder than you to take your job, and now mm. they're just waiting for you to fuck up, like, You know them ones there? 100%. So a lot of people are trying to get, they're getting grat- gratification from the downfall of others instead of actually working hard. Mm-hmm. You know, like that. So any opportunity people have to try fuck you, they're going to do it, innit? Mm-hmm. And that's the society we live in, and it's, it's trash, bro. That's why with the Kanye thing, yeah, Adidas, yeah, can't... They should have never been in a position where they could be like, yo, we're going to cancel your contract, yeah, mm. because of X, Y, Z. But Kanye wanted them to cancel it mm. anyway because he had a shit deal. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, when I read, he was only getting like 8% or something like that. Mm. And now he's renegotiated a better deal for himself. And mm. he and he done that on purpose to get out the deal. Mm. But the point is, yeah, like, regardless of what man said, yeah, like, man saying, what, we're just going to just rip up a deal because people on the internet are upset. Mm. Like, these are not people buying Yeezys, blood. Because mm. the people that buy Yeezys are still going to buy Yeezys or mm. else they wouldn't have given him the deal back if they thought mm. he was cancelled. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If yeah, they yeah, knew yeah, he yeah, wasn't yeah. going to sell the trainers, mm-hmm, they mm-hmm. wouldn't have said, yo, we need you. Mm, Do you know mm, what I mean? Mm, but mm, most mm. of the guys that wear Yeezys look like Kanye. Mm. So they're still going to buy it. Mm. You know, like that. And and that's just what it is. So these men knew that what he said, although it outraged people online, yeah, it wasn't going to slow down his sales. That's why they're now trying to get him back. Or else, mm. if they knew they weren't going to make no money out of it, they wouldn't be asking him to come back. 
Mm. You see what I'm saying? And that's what it is. They gave Gary Lineker the job back here yeah, only because no one else wanted the job. No, they gave him the job back because he's mixed race, blood. <laughs> <laughs> oh my days, blood! This guy, <laughs> bro, remind Remember people. He came this out. idiot is the <laughs> same guy that said he got racially abused, you know, because because the color of his skin. This asshole that people are feeling sorry for. I'm just glad he got his job back here, yeah, just because, yeah. It sets a bad precedent if he loses his job because of it. Bro, but him as a person, I don't give a shit about bro, Gary Lineker. When he Lineker. looks in the mirror, he thinks his name's Garnet Lineker. <laughs> <laughs> Man said he's good because of his big nose. <laughs> man said Garnet. Garnet Lineker, no, blood, bro. No, bro, bomb. Yo, blood, it's mad, you know. Yo, this guy's oh, a fool, blood. I don't even God. like him, blood, but I'm oh. glad he got his job back, even though he's an idiot. No, nah, I like him. I don't like John Barnes. That's, I don't no, but John Barnes, yeah, bro. Someone woke John Barnes up because John Barnes was talking about the Gary Lineker situation Gee, and I he was talking more I sense. I just can't listen to him no more. So I know, might, I know, I know. He may, know. like, he in the last two more years, sense he might else. actually be the guy. But I've just, you know, when I see his face, yeah, I yeah. just change nah, the nah, channel. No, 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 bro. Because he was doing the Uncle Ruckus thing, blood. But you oh, know what God, it is, yeah? I don't like that, brother. Like, he was even speaking about the Lineker thing, yeah? And he mm. was making mad sense. And the thing is, it's like, you can't sack a man for that. Mm. Do you understand? Like, and the way he broke it down was that, yeah, like, basically, you cannot sack man. It makes no sense. Mm. And this is where common sense has to come in, bro. And that's why I don't like this this court of public opinion now. Mm. Do you know what I mean? It's the same thing now that's happening at Man United now. With Mason, we're going to see it. The court of public opinion. Mm. Because he's been basically proven not guilty, acquitted, mm. all of these things. But the court of public opinion is going to mm. decide whether he plays for the club again. You know, like that. That's what it will be. He's going to get abused regardless. Bro. But he's going to get abused regardless. You got, man, you got man that have done nothing, yeah? And you're singing, on a bender, so and so, with an offender. Yeah, exactly. You got man that have done nothing. I'm not talking about Cristiano either. You just got man that have done nothing. No, you got I, no, man, you're you got right. man that started YouTube channels, they're singing that. About, <laughs> that no, you're right. Ridiculous. But bro, the court of public opinion, bro, because now there was even talk saying, oh yeah, apparently some of the, the women players at Man United don't want him back and all these things. Bro, you don't pay his wages. It's not... It's the women cares. players? Yeah, they're saying... We got all, he don't train with you, but man. but that's what I'm trying to say. But the point you is need to focus on the, the the Warsaw Premier League. Blood. But bro, this is the point. It's the court of public opinion. So now everyone's got an opinion, yeah, and everyone can have some sort of influence on the future of others and all those things. When mm. really they shouldn't have a fucking say, bro, because they don't employ him. Mm. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, if by law my man is found not guilty for something, yeah, Twitter are not in a place to be fucking deciding who's guilty and who's not guilty. That's what we have the fucking law for. A you man know, put, like that. A man put one in the oven, like, like some microchips, blood. Well, you there know, you go. There, so that kind of kills the whole argument. Telling you know, you, like blood. that. But say no more. Dave just messaged me and told me we're at an hour and 15 minutes. I don't know if he's a, if he's a man that doesn't like employment, blood, because my <laughs> podcast hasn't got a cap. You know, them way there on it, yeah. But yeah, you get me for viewing purposes, blood. We'll round it off, blood. Anyway, we've spoken about anything, everything anyway. Yeah, we you get me, fam. Let's just get into our um, Oozing Sorcery Award, Walla Did a Week, Bonafide Bomb of the Week. Oozing Sorcery Award, you, you want to give that to, blood? Know, Mo Salah, bruv, he broke another record, blood. That's the first time he's missed the target from the penalty spot, bruv. You know oh, is it? I mean? Yeah, the first time he missed the target completely. You, yeah, you gave him the Oozing Sorcery Award? Yeah, well, he, well, he got it last week. <laughs> you know, but for no, breaking a record. No, so I gave him it this week for no, breaking another one. he got bonafide. One. Oh, you're a dick. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's two Say records no in a week. Say no more, blood. Say no more. Most salary is bona fide hey, bum. And um, while I did a week, you know them way right there. If you want to give that to bona fide bum of the week is that fucking referee? What's his name? Anthony Taylor, fam. You know them fucking right there. boiled egg, man. Say no more, blood. While I did a week, um, forward for a triangle. What the? <laughs> Casemiro. I'm joking. Nah, nah, nah. You want to give that to blood? I ain't really even got any. I, I brother, I'm, I'm, I'm in Dubai right now, G. You know them way there, I'll be honest, blood. And anyway, if you got to the end of the episode, what do they type in, blood? If the ball wasn't a sphere, blood. If the ball wasn't a sphere, blood. Ranceroni 2023, blood. You know them way there. Yeah, if the ball wasn't a sphere. Ranceroni 2023. And I'm off to Dubai. But Bant Sports Ooze will be back next week.